Good morning class and welcome to your first activity, your first lesson video, my bad, for this week. Hope you all are ready to study and I hope you all had a great weekend and you're staying safe and healthy. So, today we're going to be talking a bit about nouns. And yes, we are still busy with a Where Would I Live storybook. So let's start talking about nouns. Can you say it with me? Nouns. Nouns. Yes. So we're not doing all those fancy stuff, demonstrative pronoun, this and that. He, she, is. We all finished with that, we know it. Today we're going to talk about a normal noun. Now, a normal noun. It is a naming word that refers to a person, an animal, place, or thing. So, a person, animal, place, thing. Say it with me. Person, place, animal, thing. My bad. Person, animal, place, thing. Person, animal, place, thing. Now those four stuff we call nouns. It is a naming word for those four. Person, animal, place, and thing. Now in our book, where would I live? We have a lot of nouns. So we have person, place, animal, thing. Teacher actually did switch this as well. So in this book, let's start with person. In the book, we have a person. Can you remember what was the person's name? Right here. There's a person. His name was Robin Hood. So if I tell you, what is the noun? Where is the noun in this book? Robin Hood is a noun because he's a person, right? Now look at that. Whose name is that? That is my name. Am I a person? Yes. So that is a noun. Alright? Because the, it's the naming word. It is the name of the person. Or the name of the place. The name of an animal or the name of a thing. That's why they say naming word. Alright? So let's go to place. Now in our book, there's a lot of places. Can you name some? Place like barn. Yes, the barn is where they keep all the farm animals or the horses or the cows. Or we had what was made of ice. Igloo. Igloo, very good. And then, where do we have to study? Where do we go to study? School. So any place, school is a place. Your home is a place. You can say Aeon, the mall. You can say Siem Reap or Batambaham or wherever. It's all a place and we call and it's a noun because it's the name of the place. Alright, I do hope you remember that. So let's do animals. Animals are easy. What animals do you remember in the book though? Yes, I know we saw a bear, but it didn't say bear. There's a bear, but there's nowhere a bear to be, to be read. But what about these three blind? 
Mice. Very good. Mice is a animal. What other animals do you know? Lion is a noun. Zebra is a noun. Elephant is a noun. Cow is a noun. Pig is a noun. Dog, cat. Oh my gosh. All the animals you can think of is a noun because it is the name. Name of the noun. It's a naming word. Alive like you and me. We are alive. We can breathe. So we are not things. We are persons. We are living things. When we talk about things here, they talk about non-living things. Things that cannot breathe. Like, what is this? A book. Is the book alive? Can you walk away? No, we cannot. So it's a thing. What things did we see in the book? We had a... What did we do on the river? We row on a boat. A boat is a thing. This book is a thing. This marker is a thing. Eraser, bottle. In the book they say fountain. Remember fountain, that is also a thing. All right, class? So these are our nouns for today. I need you to go practice your book again and see how many nouns can you find in your book. Now you need to remember the rules of the nouns. A noun is a naming word that refers to a person animal, place, or thing. Person, animal, place, or thing. Person, animal, place, or thing. And those we call nouns. I do hope you all listened to me today in class and enjoyed your first lesson video. And this afternoon I will send you a nice little cartoon about nouns. Maybe only if you guys behave and I do hope you watch this lesson because knowing these rules is very important. Please wait a few minutes for your activity video to come. Thank you very much.